Hey, come here. I left some things in the lab. We need to talk about Dr. Kessler. clinic. I know you're worried about Dr. Kessler, but he's not like Marcus. Dr. Kessler spent years assisting the World Health Organization and did groundbreaking research on how viruses mutate when they come into contact with external factors. And sure, he might be a tad eccentric, but who isn't these days? Yeah, well, you better be right, because I've had my fail of crazy-ass scientists doing crazy shit. Trust me, he's a good man. He wouldn't harm a fly. Are you ready to go? Sure. Good. Please come here. Hi, I'd come like to here. Ask you Hopefully, Kessler isn't a loon like Marcus was. Stay focused out there. You hear? Better give us the map, or I'll tear his ass a new one.
fucking do it again. All right, Harlow. I'm at Kessler's outpost. All right. Find a way in. Oh, great. Another rundown shithole. Hope that intercom works. Kessler, you in there? Who is it? What do you want? I need your help, Kessler. Please, let me in. I am busy doing serious research here. I have no time for visitors. Leave me be. Sir, it, it's about that research. I read your study on Kuru disease and I... Well, I thought it was right on target. I just have a few questions about it. I swear I can't get a moment's peace around here. Very well, come in. Well, and what do we got here? Damn, an article about Marcus's research in biology. Kind of impressed. Here we go. I knew there had to be some fucked up shit I somewhere in here. Dead. All right, I let you in. Now tell me Nobody what you and want. Howard were lost in Kundera. Johnson was attacked by this abomination. <laughs> Murphy put a bullet in him as his yeah. screams were raising the dead. At least they look and smell bloody dead, but I mean, how can that be? I came All from right, the jungle. I let you in. Now tell me what you want. Like hungry animals. Miller panicked and ran into a whole mob of them. They fell on him like rabid dogs, tore him to pieces, and the rest of us barely made it out alive. I was bitten on the shoulder, and the others were sure the infection would take me as well. And soon after we All went right, to sleep, I let you in. Now tell me what you want. Try to murder me. I had no choice but to shoot the bloody maniac. Everyone's scared to death. At this point, I think our only option is Henderson. At least there's a military base there. Most of our families are there as well. I just hope the city's still safe. I heard you know a way to Henderson through the old Japanese tunnels. There aren't any tunnels. Now get out of here. I am a scientist, not a tour guide. Stop wasting my time. Marcus Villa told me about the tunnels. Now, just tell me what I need to know. You saw Marcus? I haven't seen him in ages. He was brilliant, you know, in his own way. But let us just say there are reasons we no longer work together. Very good reasons. Yeah, well, he tried to eat me, so hearing that you kicked him to the curb isn't a huge shock. He wanted to eat you? That doesn't make any sense. Sure, he went to live with the natives, but they've always struck me as peaceful people. Perhaps he was worse off than I even imagined. But that does not explain why he would resort to cannibalism. I'm immune to the plague, and he thought my flesh was the key to a cure. Wait a moment, are you saying that you are immune to what's happening out there? And then, this certainly changes things, doesn't it? Yes, I'm afraid it does. Yeah, I have a map that you should find helpful. But if you want it, you need to help me with something. I have been researching this disease for many years now. Kuru has been endemic to the indigenous people here for centuries. This outbreak is one of many, and each incident is a little different, as is the trigger that reawakens the plague. It's truly remarkable how this prion disease adapts from changes, how it mutates when exposed to external factors, the speed at which it affects the host organism. Astonishing, really. But science can be unpredictable. Dangerous, even, you understand? Yeah. Yeah, I can see the bodies from here, Doc. A truly unfortunate accident, one that was largely the fault of my assistants. I assure you, I had very little to do with what happened out there. Yeah, yeah, tell someone who gives a rip. What do you want from me? I am merely trying to make it clear that I am not an evil man. 
In times such as these, it is easy for men of science to be blamed, persecuted for their actions. Especially by people who possess lesser minds. My four assistants were in possession of some reagents, chemicals, contained within vials. Unfortunately, those vials are out there in the greenhouse. Bring them to me, and I will give you the map. Do we have a deal? Yeah, I'll give you a hand. You will probably need to kill all four of them in order to secure the vials. But there is no saving them now. You will be putting them out of their misery. Find that map and have it ready to go. I cannot conduct my tests Shit, without the mess. reagents. Do this task for me. Thank <laughs> you. 
Got it. I used to be a professional fucking athlete. <laughs> that reagent is mine.
Got it. That's the last regent. Now I can conduct my tests. I only require a sample of your blood. If you don't give me the map, I'm gonna feed your ass to your infected pals. Got it? I am doing a poor job of explaining myself. You are clearly immune, that much is certain. But that does not mean that you are safe. There is a strong possibility that the virus is in your body. And if it is, it could mutate. And depending on how it mutates, you could be in grave danger. All I need is a small blood sample. I run a simple test and then we'll know. This is for your own good. All right, go for it. Okay, you will feel a little prick. Nothing to worry about. Don't see that wasn't so bad, was it? If I had a little sweet, I would give you one. When this is all over, you need to have your head examined. I was merely trying to lighten the mood. Oh, it will only take a moment to prepare the sample. Please be patient. This is truly astonishing. Well, what do we got here? I got your results. You are completely resistant to the virus. Tell me something I didn't know. No, it is not what you think. Your resistance to the virus has kept it from multiplying, from wreaking havoc on your body. But it has not destroyed the virus. It has merely suppressed it. You need to be very careful. Any contact with certain types of reagents could trigger a mutation. And if the virus mutates, it stands to reason that you could lose your immunity. Or much, much, much worse. Unfortunately, there are so many factors to consider that it is impossible for me to tell you exactly what might happen. But one thing is clear. You should avoid anything that would put you at risk. What do you mean? Your plan was to use the tunnels to reach Henderson, correct? Yes, the Japanese created them during World War II, and later they were used to store chemical weapons. In the 50s, during a monsoon, there was a leak when some of those chemicals worked their way into the water. The Aussies sent in a battalion of engineers and soldiers to clean them up, but they weren't successful. When they went into the tunnels, one of them must have been infected. The virus mutated and all hell broke loose. The Aussies had to blow the entrances to prevent the infection from spreading. Most of the men were still down in the tunnels. I have long suspected that exposure to those chemicals is what caused the infected soldier to mutate. Anyway, you need to find the old Jesuit mission. A passageway runs from the ruins down into the tunnels. Here is the map, as I promised. I cannot stop you from going down there. That is your decision. But if you do, use an abundance of caution. Try to avoid prolonged exposure to the chemicals. I wish you best of luck. Thanks. Harlow, answer the radio. Thank God I was starting to worry. Did you get the map from Kessler? Yeah, I got it. Gonna be a pain going through the tunnels, though. You can fill me in when we meet up. Where are you going now? To find the entrance to the tunnels. What do you need? We need more data for my research if I'm going to be able to help you. If you're heading to the tunnels, please be observant. 
Bring me whatever unusual you find there. Will you? Yeah. Excellent. There might be a strange substance or, or a monster that you have not seen before. Maybe some trace from the Australian force. This shit's getting tired. you at all, do they? <laughs> Take anything you want. Anything. I must go to my children. They must be terrified. Fuck yeah. Damn. Even I'm impressed. You see the entrance? Don't sweat me. I'll find it. Damn, this place is pretty sweet.
Well, and what do we got here? <laughs> That's it. Huh. There's a door here. I got some stairs that lead down into a crypt, Hardy. How's the entrance? Is it accessible? Ah, fucking thing's flooded. Shit. All right. Stay there. We're on our way down. Maybe Trevor can figure something out. Oh, great. I'll just stand here and wait to get eaten. Fuck me. Jesus, that was close. You good? Okay, Trevor, get us out of here. Have you thought about checking the beach? Will you check on something for me? I so left some things in her life. Around in those That's dark a shit ton of water. Yeah, you got any dead. tricks up your sleeves? You. I need a pump. Before we left, I talked to an old man from Hawaii. He worked in these tunnels when the Aussies were here. And he said there's still equipment in a workroom not far from here. There should be a pump in there. Can you bring it back? I'll give her a shot. Good. Once you bring the pump back, I'll take care of this water. I need your help. This better work. That's all I can say. How can I help? If I can electrify the fences, those damn things will fry when they run into them. But I need a power source. Cables and batteries should do it. Will you bring me some? Sure. The cables are in a shack not far from here. And the batteries are at a camping site. I need my book from my clinic. Have you thought about checking the beach? Holy shit! Some vacation is turned out to be, eh? We can't afford to lose anyone. I hope the bridges this pump the idea works. We've wasted too much time already. Ah, oh, you can always count. Can do. We had to protect these people from murder them. I told Colonel Ormsby, my commanding officer, that I would not order my men to murder innocent civilians. Colonel Ormsby said refusal to follow orders would cause him gross insubordination, and my men and I would be charged with desertion and arrested as traitors. Hold up, men. Looks like uh, uh, some sort of research facility ahead.
get bored, bastards. All they wanted was a little time to relax. Here it is. need. somewhere.
fool! Trevor will know how to get this door open. Look at that pump. Hurry. Very good. Give me a moment, and I'll electrify those fences. This is for you. I think I know a way to improve our defenses. Come here. I'd like to ask you something. Now what? We just wait here. What's going on? <laughs> Watch it! Trevor on top of that shit, man. Questions, floods, and what's next? A rain of fire? Shit. Did some damage. I know it's here. Good news, brother. I've got the pump. Right. Bring it here. Yeah, on my way. Is out of control and spreading across the island. 
I have family in Henderson, but no one will bloody tell me what's happening there. If they're so worried about... ...containing the bloody infection, why would they tell us to evacuate? They said we'd be safer. Did you hear that? Is that air support? Are they airdropping supplies for the villagers? I hope so, those people are starving. It makes sense they've dropped air supplies since they've located the highway in and out of... Oh my god, what are they doing? Are they firebombing the bloody village? Jesus Christ, they're burning them alive! This can't be right! What the hell are they doing? Oh, fuck yeah! Trevor will know how to get this door open. Yeah, you're all welcome to help out any time. I hope this pump idea works. We've wasted hey, too much time already. I have an idea. Have you thought about checking the beach? The beach. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Something for me? Let's get to it. I hope this pump idea works. We've wasted too much time already. Ah, <sighs> oh, I'd kill for a hot shower right now. Left some things in her life. Well, if you're ready, is this sucker gonna work? Yeah, this is an old rusky machine. Let's hope those commies knew what they were doing. Absolutely. Let's see what it can do.
extraordinary Behind circumstances. Them. I have an idea. Please come here. I'd like to ask. The noise from the pump is going to keep attracting them. And it's going to take a while to drain all that water. There's no way we'll survive with the weapons we have. I say we use the mines, blow those bastards to hell. They'll help, but they're not going to be enough. Listen, a military chopper went down near the village. None of the poor bastards on board survived the crash, but their weapons might have. Head over there and see what you can salvage. Yes. And get back here as soon as you can. If those things attack while you're gone, we're finished. Remember, we got that box full of mines, too. Too bad this pump is so damn loud. We should make sure this area is secure before turning on the pump. God only knows how many of those things are out in the jungle. Yeah, once we get the water down, the Let's door should be a problem. Let's put these mines to good use. Just don't blow yourself up in the process. Material by the walls. Use it to set up a barrier. It's never that easy, is it? Go look for the chopper. thing hauls ass. Found the chopper. It's trashed. Look inside. There's got to be something we can use. Oh shit! HMGs, Colonel. We have goddamn HMGs here. All right, then. Come on back, and we'll get this party started.
Keep an eye out. Remember, we got that box full of mines, too. You got this! Watch it! Hey! That's an idea. Remember, we got that box full of mines, too. You undead douchebags like it loud? I'll yeah. give you loud. Headshot! Jesus! That pump is basically a dinner bell. It's going to attract every dead asshole in this area. We can move the gun to another spot. Watch yourself. We just have to hold on long enough. going to protect us. We need to use the mines. No! Hey! I have an idea. Now what? We Start the pump, Trevor. The sooner we get out of here, the better. All right, you sure? Everybody ready? I'll give her a shot. All right, then. You better get out there and give the others a hand. Move it 
to the other side. Do it from the back to back. They're surrounding us from a cemetery. Don't let them get behind you. Put up barricades. How are you doing? Watch it. Headshot. Barricades up.
racket! They're coming! Oh, fuck. fuck yeah! Good job, everybody! Good job, everyone! Good job, everyone! Time to get this plan into action! Don't forget to resupply. Hey, nice job. I have an idea. I left the some water's things all at pumped home. out, and the entrance is wide open. All right, then. I'm going deep. You stay here and keep the home fires burning, brother. We don't know what's down there, so be careful. Stay on the radio. I'll let you know if I find a way through. Good luck. Sure. All right, take care down there. We'll follow as soon as we get the all clear from you. Careful! I need my book from the end. Lots of water down here, Harlow. Just keep going. Those tunnels yeah. are the only way to hit yeah. it. Damn, it's dark down here. The Japanese probably strung up the lights back when they were using the tunnels. See what you can... Hey, I found an old generator. Let's we'll see if it'll fire up. Copy that. Got my fingers crossed for you. Hey, something went my way. Come on, baby. Daddy needs something to go his way. Harlow, can you hear me? Shit, lost her. If we're gonna use these tunnels, I really need to find some more lights. Flares. I wonder who else was down here. Of course, the infected have to be here too. I really hope this tunnel leads to Henderson. This is for you! Please, let there be a generator in here. Hello? Are you there? Can you hear me? I hear you. Damn tunnels are jacking up our signal. I was afraid we lost you. What about the chemicals? Have you come across them? No, I haven't seen any chemicals. Just those shit-eating infected. Alright, just be careful. Talk to you soon. Bring in the wood. Hey, something went my way. Whatever that 
this. It smells like shit. And the other shoe drops. I knew it'd run into this shit eventually. Take a long time to build. Fuck, look at that radar. The Japanese built all of this? Can't hurt to look. Smells like, man, I'll be lucky if I don't turn into a walking nightlight. Hey, Harlow. How are you progressing? Well, I'm still alive, so that's something. Lots of chemical barrels, though. I'm doing my best, but there's no avoiding the fumes. I know, and we'll be ready. Just be sure that you... Harlow, you there? Shit. Well, that's all I need. Can't wait to breathe fresh air again. Get away from that chemical shit. And Logan said, let there be light. Oh fuck, I've been down here too long. Starting to lose it.
Hmm, something good in here. Get the hang of this. Harlow, that you? Did you find the exit? It's locked. Got into a fight with some smugglers. Look around. Maybe one of those dead smugglers has the key. Let me know when the door's unlocked. Oh. Oh. I'm at the exit, Harlow. I'm on my way out. That's great news. We'll be there as soon as we can. Yeah! We did it! Thank God we had the rule. I didn't think I'd ever see daylight again. Mate, are you okay? Shit. What happened to you? Some... Somebody pushed me. Hey, man, what happened? Who pushed you? Stay away! What the hell is that? That fuck we put all of us in danger. What? What is it? Oh, shit. What? He's gonna turn. Maybe we can restrain him. Oh, God. No. There's nothing to be done. I knew he was bitten, so I pushed him. You what? What the hell were you thinking? He was already lost. You would have left him behind. But I had to know what that mutagen would do to someone who was infected! Oh my god! What the fuck? Jesus! Look at him! Please, come here. I'd like to ask you something. Look at the size of this highway. <laughs> what would they think of building something like that in a dinky little island? I think I know why I left three months. Months. Kill him! Fuck! He's gonna kill us all! Wayne! What the fuck, man? Oh my god. Wayne! Holy shit. Wayne?
You're not gonna change too. We can't stay here. We need to get everyone to Henderson as soon as possible. Which way is Henderson? We're going to have to cross a small bay. There used to be an old ferry that the locals used to get back and forth. See if you can get it going. Once you've found a way across, the rest of us will link up with you. Are you ready? I'll give her a shot. Watch your back. We'll join you once you've cleared the way. I heard that some escaped prisoners might be in the area. Be careful. I already told you. We have to know what we're dealing with. If the infection spreads beyond the island, the entire world... Ah, fuck. Kessler, pick up. I need your help. What happened? Are you... Right? I warned you about going through those tunnels. Listen to me, Kessler. We might be in deep shit. This guy named Wayne was exposed to those damn chemicals, and he's changed. You hear me? He changed into a monster. I mean, what the fuck, man? Is this gonna happen to me? I honestly don't know. He had to be infected. Otherwise, exposure to those chemicals wouldn't have resulted in a mutation. They would have made him ill, perhaps fatally so, but that would have been the extent of it. As for the mutation itself, it appears to be random, based on a person's genetic makeup and other factors. What was your exposure level? What about fumes? Did you wear a mask? How much of it did you breathe in? Well, is this some kind of joke? I breathed in a lot of that shit. You didn't say dick about wearing a mask. Exposure at any level has the potential to be dangerous. But since you have not already been adversely impacted, the fumes must not have been enough to trigger a large-scale mutation. I'm afraid to say that I have to study this further before I can draw any conclusions. In the meantime, watch for anything out of the ordinary. I will let you know as soon as I learn anything of interest. Kessler, don't hang up! You there? Ah, oh, damn it! That had to hurt. Must be Henderson over there. There's the ferry station. Pretty damn quiet around here. Maybe they'll leave me alone if I play nice. Help me, God damn it!
back and mess with me. I need to go so this way. You guys don't have a problem with that, do you? Those no, things. we don't care. As long as you pay us what we want, you can do whatever the fuck you want. <sighs> How much? Everything you're carrying. Money, weapons, ammo, supplies, all of it. Now hand it over. Oh, you're funny, you know that? <laughs> a regular fucking comedian. Fine. We'll just kill you, and then take your shit. Makes no difference to me. Kill him! Oh, Shoot him! What's happening to me? Oh, I think I'm going to be sick. Are you there, Kessler? Answer me! Yes, I'm here. Has something happened? I went fucking berserk. That's what happened. Just calm down. There's no reason to get hysterical. Now it sounds like the virus has mutated, but it appears to be very minor. I don't think you're in any real danger. You definitely want to limit your exposure to any additional mutagens. Ah, oh, fuck me. And what happens if I go berserk again? I suspect you have had similar symptoms before, but not so overwhelming. The fury of feeling, that is the result of the mutation. It amplifies the release of large quantities of corticosteroids from the adrenal cortex. The mutation will not progress if you can avoid exposure to the mutagen again. But continual exposure can cause further, even more dangerous mutations. Turning you into something, uh, something quite horrifying. Perhaps instead of viewing this as a negative, you should embrace it. Learn to control it. Focus it. Given the state of the world, a little extra something can be a bad thing. Right. Now, if you will excuse me, I have uh, a situation to deal with. Where the fuck is it? You have to help me! Oh, please! Please don't kill me! It's okay, I'm here to help. No problem. So how'd you end up with those dickweeds? I was going to Henderson to try and find my family, and those damn prisoners caught me. They said they were going to use me as bait in case the infected attacked those bastards. Anyway, my name is Marvin. I owe you one. You know how to start the ferry? You help me and we're even. Yeah, of course I know. I worked there for 16 years, give or take. It's right here. I found a guy who knows how to run the ferry. We'll chill until you get here. Understood. We're on our way. See you soon. Better get these barricades up. They're coming from the gate! Yeah, fuck you! Fuck, they're already here. You gotta be fucking kidding me. They're already here. Dead. Infected. Put up barricades! I see Cover them. the gap!
foot. Okay, remember, that ferry engine is going to be loud. We need to be ready for anything. Get out of fences, ready. That ferry engine is fucking loud. Much louder than that water pump. All right, the engine on the ferry is going to be loud. We need to be ready. Yeah, you're all welcome to help out any time. Hey, please, oh, I have come an here. idea. Why are we waiting? Something. The engines are really loud. I want to get out of here as bad as... I can't really turn you down Yeah, now, let's do I? this. I'll need a couple of minutes to get the engine started. I left some things in Halai.
Listen, we need to keep moving. Get in! Go! Go! I Have left you thought about checking the beach? Will you check on something for me? Oh, for hey, sake. I have an idea. I need my book from my... We can't go anywhere until we find some kind of shelter. Maybe you can clear the square and see what's there. We can't stay here out in the open. No sense in getting worked up. The military might have just pulled back and established a defensible perimeter around the base. Let's get out of the rain and hit inside the surrounding Time to die! Get away! Yeah, Why do they have all that equipment if they're not going to use it? Can you clear out any buckers in there? Once we're holed up in the get cinema, it. I'll try to contact Briggs. Infecting! Let's give these fuckers a flogging. Shake infecting! I was really hoping We're up shit's creek me. now. Let's get out of the No ring. sense in getting worked up. Infecting. The Infecting. military might shit. have just pulled back and established a defensible perimeter they around are. the base. Someone needs to recon the city. Get a handle on things. Sure, this looks pretty dead. Around here, we, really we need somewhere to safe to hide. How about that old shack? It should hold up for a bit, but we not get stay forever. I have an idea. Oh, fuck! Someone needs to recall the city. Get out of here. Standing around here with all this shit. It's clear. We need to stay focused, understand? It's the only way we're getting out of this. Once we're secure, we can worry about what's going on with the base. There were a lot of soldiers here. They should have been more than capable of handling the outbreak. I wonder what happened. It's strange that the military hasn't done anything. I left some things in the line. Been overrun. Heard you know about a safe place in town. There's an old movie theater called Jacqueline's. It don't have any exterior windows, so once the doors are barricaded, we should be fairly safe. It also has a bar, or used to anyway, so once we're over there, we'll have plenty to eat and drink. Jacqueline should still be there, assuming she survived. She loved that place, and I no can imagine her abandoning it. So, what you think? Will you go check it out? Yeah, I'll give you a hand. The theater shouldn't be far from here. Let me know when you get over there. Hey, Once we hold up in the I cinema, I'll try to contact Briggs. Please, come here. I'd Good like luck to ask out you something. there. I need my book from my clinic. No sense in getting worked up. 
The military might have just pulled back and established a defensible perimeter around the base. Was the theater overrun? Is Jacqueline still hey! alive? Oh, I have an idea. There were a lot of soldiers here. I should have been more than capable. It's true. This looks pretty bad. I was really hoping that the infection hadn't made it. Damn it, locked. I need to find a key. Since the entire town... The military hasn't done anything. Why do they have all that equipment if they're not going to use it? Town's flooded too. I just hope another storm don't hit.
That's it. Here we go. Damn, whole theater's overrun, Hardy. Time to whoop some ass. Copy that. Killed all the fuckers in the lobby. I'm heading to the theater. Thanks for the update. from Henderson, are you? No, I'm from the States. Listen, me and the folks I'm with uh, need a place to hide. We were hoping to use your theater. There's more than enough room for everyone. That won't be a problem. You'll need to fortify all of the entrances first, though. Make sure those beasts can't find another way in. There are security shutters at the front and rear of the building. The rear shutter hasn't been used in ages, though. To activate it, you need a key from the lodge. Thank you again. If it wasn't for you, I'd be dead. Well, what do we got here? for the others to join us. A hostel in town was turned into a kind of field hospital. You might want to go over there. If you need more information, speak with Cecil. The theater's secure. I even found another survivor. Did you hear that? We're going to be all right. We're all on our way.
Thanks again for rescuing me. I thought for sure I wouldn't survive. It looks like you could all use a place to heal and rest up. This is hopeless. Where will we go? They are already there. Well, at least we have a roof over our heads here. When the plague first hit, everyone left. I thought the authorities would eventually come, so I stayed behind. I was worried about looters. Little did I know that would be the least of my worries. Everything I own is in this theater. I couldn't bear to leave it behind. But now, after all that's happened, I'd like to go with you. You're welcome to come, but no promises. We're all in the same boat here, and as far as I can tell, this son of a bitch is sinking. Any luck contacting the base? No. Maybe their radio is down. What the hell happened here? The disease spread so quickly, the army created a quarantine zone. They said they had it under control. But they did. From the outside, the base looks intact. As I said, Commander Briggs is a friend of mine. This base is our only chance for rescue. We must get in there. I wouldn't. The military abandoned this town and everyone in it. They locked themselves in that base. Anyone who approached, anyone seeking shelter, was shot. After a while, people stopped trying. Bloody heroes, eh? Jesus. Look, they must have thought those citizens were infected. Otherwise, they would never have done something like that. Sure they would. Just like they did in Benoit, just like Norlis. Man, that's just how it works. Is Harlow here? I thought she was with you. Who saw her last? I... I thought... We ran like crazy. I thought she was with us. Fuck! You left her behind, just like you'd leave us all. Jesus Christ, woman. Get a grip. Or what? You gonna hit her? Chima is right. All you immunes are getting a little crazy. Crazy how? What the hell are you saying? You don't trust us now? Well, maybe we don't fucking trust you. Everybody, just calm down. It's the chemicals, the mutagens. Look at them. They can barely control themselves. Come on, people. We've gone too far to give up now. Stay here while you check the base. If the guards make trouble, I'll talk to them on the radio. It's the only way we're getting out of this alive. Do your job. We're leaving no one behind. <laughs>